Hello there friends, this is Robin Norgren and I'm your host for Montessori, Creativity and the Meaning of Life. We're in the middle of a series called Love Poems from God. It is looking into 12 sacred voices recognized throughout um, history from the East and the West, the poetry that they've offered through the world and what they would describe as poetry that they have been used as conduits to bring to the world to represent God's love for us. We've looked at the work of Rabia and Rumi and St. Francis of Assisi and Meister Eckhart and uh, St. Thomas Aquinas, and we are now beginning to listen to the poetry of uh, Havis. So, here we go. The first poem is called Startled by God. Not like a lone, beautiful bird, These poems now rise in great white flocks, startled by God breaking a branch when his foot touches earth near me. Positions of Love There are so many positions of love, each curve on a branch. One thousand ways your eyes can hold us. The infinite shapes each mind can draw. The spring orchestra of scents and sounds wafting through the air. The currents of light combusting like passionate lips. The revolution of the universe's skirt whose folds contain other worlds. Our every sigh that falls against his inconceivably close, omnipresent, divine body. Lousy at math. Once a group of thieves stole a rare diamond larger than two goose eggs. Its value could have easily bought 3,000 horses and 3,000 acres of the most fertile land in Shiraz. The thieves got trunk, drunk that night to celebrate their great haul, but during the course of the evening, the effects of the liquor and their mistrust of each other grew to such an extent they decided to divide the stone into pieces. Of course, then, the priceless became lost. Most everyone is lousy at math and does that to God, dissects the indivisible one. By thinking, this is my beloved, he looks like this and acts like this, how could that moron over there really be God? If God invited you to a party, If God invited you to a party and said, everyone in the ballroom tonight will be my special guest, how would you then treat them when you arrived? Indeed, indeed. And Havis knows that there is no one in this world who is not standing upon his jeweled dance floor. I have come into this world to see this. I have come into this world to see this. The sword drop from men's hands even at the height of their arc of anger because they have finally realized there is just one flesh to wound and it is his, the Christ, our beloved's. I have come into this world to see this. All creatures hold hands as they pass through this miraculous existence we share on the way to an even greater being of the soul. A being of just ecstatic light, forever entwined and at play with him. I have come into this world to hear this. Every song the earth has sung since it was conceived in the divine's womb and began spinning from his wish. Every song by wing and fin and hoof Every song by hill and field and tree and woman and child. Every song of stream and rock. Every song of tool and lyre and flute. Every song of gold and emerald and fire. 
Every song the heart should cry with magnificent dignity to know itself as God. For all other knowledge will leave us again in want and aching. Only imbibing the glorious sun will complete us. I have come into the world to experience this. Men so true to love, they would rather die before speaking an unkind word. Men so true, their lives are his covenant, the promise of hope. I have come into this world to see this. The sword drops from men's hands, even at their height of the arc of their rage. Because we have finally realized there is just one flesh we can wound. Thanks so much for stopping by. Make sure and subscribe to this podcast in your favorite venue and um, share this with someone who you think might be encouraged by it. I appreciate you so much and thanks for coming by. Mm-hmm.